Don't worry, when I start sobbing, that won't seem so crass. Um, you're filthy, I can't even see you. Anyway, I, um, I'm a host here at the Slipper Room. Shut the fuck up, Big Mike. Thank God I am, because thank you, James and Camille. If I was not a host here, I'd be in a fucking a rubber cell telling dick jokes to a wall. Seriously. I'm very, 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 very grateful. And Miles, it is not your job to tell people they're assholes. It's my job. And Matthew holds claw. He gives you money? someone who's just part of your routine is you just never dream they will die. I, I obsess about my children dying. I obsess about my husband, my family, my parents dying. But, but the people in my routine, I don't even think about it. James was just James. He was just there. He was built in and we had a routine. And um, we, uh, so just some of the things that we shared that when he died, I realized I would never share with anyone again. That now they're just my memories. And um, just some of the things we would do is I would come in every night. show starts at 9.30, so I arrive at 9.25. And, uh, <laughs> I'm running in. I'm in my talks to my, my defense, but I got my bag and I'm running in. And James would go, there we go, fake heart attack every time. And I'd say, don't panic, don't panic. And I'd say, have a great show, kid. Right, and then we move on. And then I wouldn't see him all night and then as Matthew pointed out at the very very end of the show he would come up to me but we had a thing where he wouldn't even ask he would just come out and go <laughs> and I'd say say no more say no more <laughs> and then he'd come out and sing the song and um, and, at that, and to be honest I would uh, um, when he would come out and go <laughs> and I'd be so nice. I'm not Camille. I'm not letting him know that in actuality, I just wanted to go the fuck home. I'd been there since 9.30, 9.25. It was now 2 o'clock in the morning. I'd been wrangling fucking assholes all night, and I wanted to go the fuck to bed. This is a tag-on, this Uncle Earl thing. It's not part of the regular roster. It was a tag-on. It was optional, and I wanted to go the fuck to bed. for eternity, and I didn't give a fuck, but I didn't let him know. I'd go, say no more, say no more. But internally, I was rolling my eyes. Um, but now, of course, I would do anything. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Anything to get that back. Um, uh, and I guess it, the, the, the thing I just... I'm not religious at all, and I'm not spiritual, well maybe sort of in a weird way, but I swear when I'm in those back stairs by myself, you know, even if it's from inside, I feel, I feel James, and I, I miss him. He was so nice, he was so positive, he had such a kind, twinkly, like, Japanimation face. Night, you would say, great show, kids. They loved it. Did you have a good show? Yes, thank you, James. Oh, they loved you. Everyone coming out said you were the best. You're the best. You're the best. <laughs> Miles doesn't say that to me. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? No, no pressure. I beg of you, don't say that. Don't ever say that. Right? But um, but I, 
gets the strange thing about, and so he, that's all gone, and I took that for granted, and I, and uh, I just, and I guess my the final point I wanted to make is that this, the weird thing about death is, and I'm so glad I've reached a point in my life where I can acknowledge this. Um, it realize, you realize that the people you like, you actually love. And, um, and uh, yeah. <laughs> and so, uh, and there's no fucking time. There's no time. We can't dawdle. It could happen any fucking second. I had a beautiful man plucked away from me so abruptly and so randomly. And I, um, and I really wish I told him I loved him. I know he knew I loved him. Yeah. And, and, and I'm really making a, um, an effort, and it's not an effort, I just am. I'm telling more people I love them because I'm realizing I do love them. These people I only see backstage, I realize I love them. And on top of that, I stop suffering assholes. Yeah! It's true. I have lost patience with these fucking people. There's no 